I am so excited for you to hear this song. This one. So All let's right. do it. Anna May Hunter, right? In Germany, I think. Oh, okay. I was listening. <laughs> Let me watch it. Um, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that sound to come out of him. That's why I was like, huh? Yeah. I don't know. I think I wasn't expecting him to be... I think I was expecting like a rock sound. I don't know, mm -hmm. like lower. Mm -hmm. uh, like taking it down the octave, but he just fully went for it. Yeah. So up the octave, there's an interesting like raspiness going on there. Mm. Um... I want to listen more. I don't. Okay. I have nothing yet to comment. I'm, I'm going to go back a tiny bit. So you can only experience it again. <laughs> This is like, Disgust. I feel like I'm like, I don't know, like you put a box of chocolates in front of me, I've eaten one that was really good and then you give me another one and it's also like really good. It's like, right. and in, with a box of chocolates, it's a gamble. Like sometimes, <laughs> yeah, you, sure. get, sometimes you get sometimes your you Turkish get, delight. You get the coffee flavor, I like Turkish delight. Yeah, the really? coffee ones always threw me off. Oh no, yeah, so I was like, you know, you panned to this other guy and I was like, oh no, you know, and then he, I'm like, oh. Another delicious chocolate. Yes, another delicious tasty <laughs> treat. Yeah. Yeah, but like different, like completely unique. Yeah. Mm. yeah. They, they, I think they bounce off really well. Each yeah. Other. Like in the past, we're talking about oh, it's when you have one singer singing maybe two different vocal lines, it sounds very jarring. But yeah. They're two very different vocal styles and sounds, but I think it works well. Yeah, there's together. something there's something that unifies them, and it's that like there's that slight like raspy mm. kind of quality in both of their voices. Mm -hmm. This guy I'm getting a bit more Tom Waitsy kind of mm -hmm. vibes, but like a Tom Waits that can actually sing, kind right. of. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We yeah. need to do a deep dive on this guy at some yeah. point. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, let's let's continue. <clears throat> focus on the vocals, don't distract me, I'm very hair focused. This is so pretty. I love watching that. Just the focus between the two of them to make sure that their vocal delivery was completely together. Mm. If you watch the guy on the left, he's really following big hairs, Mr. 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 Giant Hairs, following his lead. You can see, like, yeah, the other guy, the taller guy is leaning in, just, like, waiting, to watching him, waiting for the, hey, I'm going to come in and blend with mm. you. And I just love to see that, that ensemble. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's really nice. for sure. I'm really interested as that, was this pre-recorded? Are they recording it live? How are they capturing such good sound from so many yeah. styles? There's no mics or anything. Um, I don't understand it. Because it's, it's a single shot camera. And from memory, the whole thing is just like this panning, but there's a yeah. lot of instruments like going on. How have they How mixed have they it? It, it must be it. it must be like pre-recorded, and that's must, must be lip syncing it now or something. Maybe. Surely, surely. Because the sound is good. The sound is good, and the they're sound, not. It's not windy. No they're outdoors. Mic there. Yep. Yeah. 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 Yeah, surely it has to be pre-recorded. I didn't even yeah. consider that, but of course, like, where is that? How? Which it means sounds, it's all fake. <laughs> it's all fake, we can't look at it now. No, it's, it's, it's definitely auto-tuned. It's done. Yeah. It's, <laughs> no, it's, it's so a, clearly it's not, it's so clearly not auto-tuned <laughs> and that's why it's great. Anyway. It's clearly just filters. <laughs>
He's smiling. Roxanne. He's loving it. So nice. Roxanne. Roxanne. Such nice harmonies. Yeah. Roxanne. But they're, but they're both, particularly him on the left, he's, he's so focused on that blend, which is what you have to be, you have to be doing that. If you're going to sing together with someone, you can't be just focusing on yourself. You have to, absolutely you have to tune into the other person who's singing at the same time, blend, match vocal quality, make sure obviously your harmony or whatever you're doing is in tune, all these different elements. Mm. And he nails it and it's really, really nice to see. I also love like he, the guy on the left, he's got this really nice vocal timbre and it's just, timbre is just like a fancy way of saying tone. Mm -hmm. It's just a French word. Musicians like to use it because it makes them feel fancy. Right. Timbre, T-I-M-B-R-E. Um, but he's got this really mournful like vocal quality I thought it was husky at the start, but now it's like quite, it seems quite pure, actually. Mm -hmm. Like, Roxanne, Roxanne. But like a bit, a bit like melancholy. Roxanne. Mm -hmm. mm, melancholy Roxanne. is a way to put it. Roxanne. Yeah, how's he doing that? It's sort of like, there's a bit of a soft palate thing happening there to kind of make it a little bit, oh, oh. A, little bit oh a little bit sad. Right. Um, but I, I like it for this, especially juxtaposed with Big Hair Man, Milky Chance. Mm -hmm. Um, with that high kind of raspy, it's a nice mix. Mm. Yeah. Oh, we don't have harmonica. Oh, excellent. Another delicious chocolate. Mm. <laughs> oh, look at him bending that note. That's nice. Yeah, it's nice to feel cool. You can't get this kind of sound. No, out on some <laughs> construction site. There's that raspy quality coming in again. Oh. <laughs> so that's that whole I think I just told you about like the false vocal folds are sort of sit above the vocal folds. Um and they you can kind of add them into the mix if you want to to add that little yeah. shame, you know. And mm. he could have just shared you with another boy, but he decided, you know what, I'm gonna make it a bit more. Yeah, crackly. Yeah. I like it. Used it well. I love the way they strip back the instrumental Roxanne. here. Roxanne. Bring in the harmonica there to make it Roxanne. slightly different from before. Kusi coming in to build the instrument. is not used enough. Yeah, it really is not. It's so good. How's it going to end? See that? I thought that was a great cover. Mm. I love the combo of those two voices. Very different vocal qualities, um, but they work well together. How do you think they'd go separately? If you just heard high raspy on its own as for a whole song, yeah. do you think you would enjoy it as much? Or do you think it, it works well because it sort of bounces off um, the low register? As like a call uh, response This kind is of such a question of taste, right? right? I would be more interested in hearing Henning's voice personally. Well, let's take an excursion then and have yeah. a listen to some more Henning. 